Hi guys, so this is going to be my review for heat free hair. I've had the hair for about mm, three to four weeks in my hair. Um, so I'm just going to give a quick review about it and just what I think about the hair so far. So I got the 18 inch and the 20 inch um, from the Fur Curls collection, which is a 3C 4A. It came in a pack like this. Um, make sure you guys can see it. And then it has the label on it. Also, um, it came in a stocking cap, which I don't have anymore. And then this was the other package. It also came with a card that had for curls on it. And it said the different things that you should use as far as shampoos, conditioners, moisturizers, and other different products to use to help the hair maintain itself. So my initial <clears throat> thoughts on the hair was when I got it, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. And then it smelled really good. I could tell they co-washed the hair with the tea tree um, oil or tea tree conditioner, so it smelled really good. Um, but my second thought was, it's a lot of hair. Like, I don't know how I'm going to be able to do this. Like, I can't have all this hair in my head. So. It was a lot of hair, um, and I got it installed um, by my girl Ty, which I'll put her information below. She's amazing. If you're in the Chicago area, you should definitely get your hair done by her. So I end up getting it cut, um, but the curls, I mean, are absolutely beautiful. Like, just up close and personal, they're just beautiful. Um, it blends with my hair very well. Um, I really love this hair. It's really low maintenance. I mean, some nights I haven't even tied up the hair and it's still good. I haven't experienced really any shedding, any tangling, single knots, none of that. Um, this is my first time buying curly hair because I typically wear my own hair. But um, as a protective style, I wanted to try this and um, my friend, she ended up seeing her Instagram page. Um, as I said before, and I'm pretty sure you all want to see the back. This is the back of the hair. So, like I said, I am in love with the hair. Okay, I feel like weighed 364 total for two bundles. And trust me when I say two bundles is enough. Like anyone who's putting past two bundles in their head is just ludicrous. Um, they're crazy. I, it's no way. It's a lot of hair, it's very full bundles. Um, like I said before, the hair is really, really good. Um, I can run like my fingers through it. It's still kind of wet because I washed it, but um, I mean, you can let it air dry, you can blow dry it. Uh, it's very accessible, very easy to work with. Um, and this is my hair at the top. But still, I mean, it blends perfectly color-wise and everything. So I'm overall very pleased with the hair. Um, I think that it should be explained that how much hair it is. I mean, I had to get it cut and shaped and like three times because it was just so massive. And then I'll also insert some pictures of how it was before I got it cut and how it is now after. Um, but I am very pleased I um, recommend this hair to anyone who wants to try it. Um, this hair too is a 3C4A like I said before but it's this the bundles I got sent. The 18 that I got received more 4A and the 20 I got received more 3, 3C. Um, they're so close in proximity as far as length that I probably should have gotten a 16 and a 20 inch to kind of really distinguish the difference because like I said, I've never ordered curly hair before so this was like a trial and error for me. But um, I definitely recommend this hair, it's amazing. I haven't had any issues with it whatsoever and I mean it's really worth the money. One thing I do want to say about curly hair in general. Okay. I feel like I have no issues with this hair for a couple different reasons. One, because I already wear my natural hair. So I know how to deal with it, I know how to care for it, I know how to moisturize it and everything. So that probably adds to me not having any issues. 
if you are not used to having your own hair out or curly hair um, one thing you don't want to do is to put your fingers through it and try and run your hand through it I mean that's like one of the things you just don't do when your hair is done and it's styled it's done you don't put your hands in it you don't be trying to do the whole fingers run through my hair situation because that messes it up um, in the morning I will say it's a very quick process for me. I get my spray bottle, I put um, Condish, Leave-In Condish by Miss Jessie's in there. I put um, some oil, like some herbal oil or tea tree oil or whatever oil you have, jojoba oil, just, just doesn't matter, it's fine. I put the oil in there and then I also put some water in there and then I shake it up. I spray the hair, separate it, just spray it with the spray all and kind of refresh it. Um, this hair does not need to be washed every day. This hair does not need to um, be shampooed every day. Um, it does not require that. I mean, literally, it's really, really low maintenance, but still, you need to care for the hair. I just don't want people to get it and just think, okay, I can just go to sleep, wake up, and it's gonna be fine. Like, you do need to put some moisturizer in it and try to take proper care of it. Um, because in the long run, it'll last you longer. Um, also, with this hair, it's pretty consistent as far as the curl patterns. So this hair, it's got a lot of volume to it. It has a lot of ease to it, bounce. It really performs like your own hair. Um, I also insert pictures of products that I use on the hair and put the link descriptions below. But this hair is really good hair. I have three lines they have for coils, for curls, and um, also for kinks. So those are the three lines that Heat Free Hair have. So I mean, check all three of those out. Um, depending on where you fall, you might be between two of them, but I would just say go on their Instagram, uh, Heat Free Hair, on Instagram, and just look at the pictures of the differences, and just look at old pictures of your hair, and then just kind of see what it is that you would need to blend your hair a little bit better. Because that's what I had to do, because I was between for coils and for curls. And I looked at some old pictures and I realized that my hair was um, more for the For Curls collection than for coils. So, you know, it's all about trial and error and just figuring that out. But the hair is amazing. Like, amazing. And I will be doing a final review in three to four weeks. So, give or take a couple weeks from now.